just a bit. I want to thank all of you for joining me. I'd like to remind you, however, you chose to be up here. <laughs> they chose right. What they're about to see, they're going to remember the rest of their lives. Well done. Enjoy yourselves. Have a great time. You, not so much. <laughs> I'm going to pass this strap down through the table. There is a small hole set at the very edge of the table. Once I've done so, big part for you. Buckle her ankles into the restraint. Thank you again for examining this. I will do the exact same thing at the opposite end of the table. There we go. Just want to make sure we're centered there. Good. Can you do this? Step around the back of the table. I'll hold the restraint up around her neck. You buckle her neck into the restraint. There, I'll hold this. You got that? Go ahead. That is good. That is, wait, too tight. Back up. You've never done this before? No. Get over there. Get in. Listen, grab the strap. Walk to the end of the strap, all the way to the end. Go ahead and pull on it and show everybody how secure that is. Good, good. All right, I need your help as well. You grab the strap and walk back slowly and bring your head down to the table. All the way to the tail end of the strap. Gentlemen, pull onto the strap against each other and hold her down to the table. Do not let it go. Tight, tight. Tara, trust me. However, this time I'll place two wooden boxes over the top of her. These boxes will be held down to the table with leather straps. So there is no way she can change her mind. Mike, to introduce to you the blade. The solo steel blade I'm going to place directly on top of Tara. I ask our individuals on stage to now step forward and verify that blade rests directly on top of Tara. You guys can reach inside. You just be careful what you touch. Check it out. Check the blade. Make sure it's solid. Make sure it rests on Tara. She can take it all down to the table. Good?
That's awesome. Ah, how'd you do this to your foot? I know you broke it.